Rahul Gandhi ji has suddenly woken up and he has come in with uh, one more radical proposal. 2005, Veerappamoli ji in the second administrative reforms commission, 10th volume, 325th page, talks about lateral recruitment, which they never had the courage to do it. 2018 onwards, more than 60 people have come in as joint secretary and director level, different, different eminent people have come in, serving for three years, extendable by two more years. After five years, they get out and get back into the private sector. Now, if you look at the data, 2004 to 2013, in the Congress period, the number of civil servants recruited, all India service, group A, group B, all, all services combined, 3,517. If you look at 10 years of NDA, 2014 to 23, it is 3,929. The recruitment is also more, lateral recruitment is also happening. EWS quota bought in, along with OBC, SC and ST, quota system maintained. And every single thing is happening. He has got a problem. Now, it's very, very unfortunate when you look at all the models of democratic governance across the world. Somebody did not take civil service, for example, you are somebody, very eminent as a journalist. You want to serve information broadcasting ministry as a joint director or as someone else. The government is giving you a chance at the age of 30, 35, 40, provided you have put 15 years of service in a, in a professional field. Then you have every right to come and serve the government of India. So Rahul Gandhi wants to stop all this and say that, oh, you missed the government service selection because age is a problem. You missed that age, after that you can't take an exam. At 45 you want to serve, is giving an opportunity to them a sin. If Rahul Gandhi ji thinks it's a sin, I'm, I'm sadly mistaken. Now he can call himself a perpetual youth leader, but he cannot take civil service exam. Can Rahul Gandhi ji take a civil service exam at 21? He cannot take, because he has crossed his age limit. Now for a common man, if he thinks he still wants to serve the government of India, it's a beautiful opportunity which is a working model, successfully happening, beautiful integration happening at that level. At the same time, the entry level of civil service is happening, no, no problem there. 150 IPS, 180 IAS, 5560 Indian Foreign Service, IRS, Customs, Central Excise, multiple services in railways, defense, DANIPS. When it is beautifully happening in the system, what is his problem? He has got a problem with Agnipath. Now he has got a problem with civil service. Now there are two kinds of leaders. Somebody who wants to bring a constructive criticism to the job at hand. Or somebody who wants to bring a destructive criticism by putting them in the forefront. Now, unfortunately, Rahul Gandhi ji is belonging to the second category, which is very unfortunate. And uncalled for as an opposition leader.